you get in the blocks and the stadium falls deathly quiet where you can hear your own heartbeat and they shoot the gun. Since 1977, no one has defeated Edwin Moses in the 400 meter hurdle. Edwin Moses, 10 years, 122 race free. There's Danny Harris, only 18, the world junior record holder. Now we have a race, now we have a competition, now we have a rivalry. Of course that's exciting, of course you want to watch it. Victory is sweet. When he did beat Edwin, he took a couple deep breaths and sucked it up and said, yeah, I did it. I qualified for the Olympic trials. The four best hurdlers in the world are in the race, and one of them won't get the opportunity to try. It was a photo finish for third place. I was 6'4", he wasn't. I was hurt, embarrassed, and now I'm on the outside looking in, not going to Seoul. Our expectations become so high or high enough that when we don't get certain things that we think we should have gotten, it really gets us upset. I was depressed and I was looking for an escape. With addictions, once you cross the line, it never gets better. I couldn't imagine the fall that Danny had and being able to get up from that. Here is a story that needs to be told. Can I get back on my feet? Can I get back to a life that's worth living? We all want our lives to count for something. The greatest fear is just to be a statistic. As long as you're still breathing every day, there's possibilities to fulfill your life.